Hi guys, Keto Boss Man here. Just gonna thought I'd do a video of a typical day. This day I'm off work today and it's 10.08 in the morning. And I've come out for my daily walk, which I'm in the process of doing now. Now you can see, I've already done 2.6 kilometers. Took me 36 minutes at the moment. Not even halfway through yet. I'm going to carry on, do my walk, keep breaking in, keeping you guys up to date. One of my typical days when I'm not in work. Right, we're just a little bit further in now. We're actually near the pyramid, which is uh, near the M60 on Brinksway. Uh, roughly about halfway, I'd say, something like that. At the moment we've done uh, 3.61k as you can see. Like I said we're up near Brinksway, near the famous pyramid in Stockport, Greater Manchester and that's part of the River Mersey. That's the uh, pyramid, just a few people about this morning. As we all know the coronavirus is uh, Doing us all in, isn't it? Keeping us uh, insane rather than sane. Right, I'm going to carry on with my walk now and uh, I'll chip in with you in a bit. Well, here we are now, Stockport bus station. It's Saturday morning, 20 to 11. One bus just arriving, and one there. Saturday morning. Like a ghost town, isn't it? Still, up to 4.46k now. Gonna carry on again. Scary that, isn't it? It's one bus in the full station on a Saturday morning. And here we are, this is the A6. It's a 192, going up to uh, Hazel Grove. And this is coming down from Stepping Hill Way. I'm gonna carry my walk now. Carry on going up. To all Stockport Cemetery. I'm going to go and uh, visit my mum and dad. And, uh, say good morning to them. Check back in a bit. Just on my way up now to the crematorium. And this is one of the shops where I get a lot of my goods from. Uh, my partner, Monica, is a Filipino. So we get most of our, or she gets most of her stuff. From here, I also do a delivery service. Absolutely super shop, so friendly. Not getting anything for uh, putting this on one of my videos. This is just purely about keto. And this shop is on the A6, just past Stockport College. Here we are, just arrived at Stockport Cemetery in Crentorium. I'm just going to nip in, say hello to my mum and dad. Before I nip in and say hello to my mum and dad, I'm just going to show you this church just outside. Stop walking. The St George's. What a beautiful church. Lovely that, eh? And that's back to where I've just come from. Okay, here we are in the creme, this patch here, to where my mum and dad's buried. Beautiful little bit, isn't it? So I'm just going to spend about five, ten minutes here and then we'll head on home. I'm on my way back now. There's the Filipino shop again. I'm on my way back down. I'm just heading back down into our Stockport. I don't want to Stockport. It's famous buildings. Stockport Masonic Guildhall. That, my friends, hires out. For wedding receptions, 
private functions, meetings, seminars, exhibitions, and it's fully licensed as well. If anybody needs anywhere for a wedding or something once all this coronavirus rubbish is over. That's one of the places you could have your reception. Oh, back on down now. So Stockport College. Just at 6.78k now. Uh, feet per minute is 90. 477 active calories I've burnt towards Mikito for the day. So 192 again. Going up towards Hazel Grove. Not many on that. If anyone, to be honest. Saturday. The 18th of April 2020. One of my off work days. Doing my exercise. Some other guy there doing his. By the way, anybody thinking why isn't AI running? Uh, I have um, arthritis in my right knee. And I'm just waiting for a knee replacement. So I can't run. That's why I do cycling, walking, and plenty of painkillers. I'm losing seven, nearly seven stone now. Uh, imagine it'd be a lot worse if I hadn't done. Catch you in a bit, boys and girls. Well, that's it. Home now. So that's my exercise walk done for this morning. There it is. 7.76k average kilometers 1459 one of the things on this uh, keto plan you've got to drink plenty of water i must drink about four or five of these a day and just a little thing there it tells you on the side but what i do because sometimes water gets a bit boring so add in a bit of the a, well I've got this one which is Morrison's own which is lemon uh, no added sugar and that's the microbes for it okay so it's showing you there just a trace in 250 mil of carbs less than 0 0.1 oh got back from my walk so I'm going to have a few blueberries as well just as a snack because I've had my shake this morning and that's my first part of the day done that's a water machine that I always use filters my water for me because obviously I drink a lot of it a bit expensive you buy in bottles so that's the morning I'll get back to you in a bit and show you what else we'll be doing all right guys today I'm going to have to uh, change my water in my fish tank. For those of you that have not seen any of this before, this is one of my hobbies. It keeps me sane. And today is one of the days that once every three to four weeks you have to change 30% of the water. So today's the day, so that's another little bit of exercise. Right, there we go. Water changed. Plants trimmed. All the dead leaves and everything taken off. Now, it's going to be dinner time. Hi guys, like I say, it's dinner time now. And today, I'm going to have... Just going to have a chicken breast, chicken leg, and a bit of uh, Nando's Perry sauce hot. It's like um, mayonnaise. And in that mayonnaise alone, there's three carbs. No carbs in chicken. So doing okay but you've got to keep an eye on your calories as well i'll work out what calories are in this and obviously uh, another cup of water i'm going to have as i've drank all the last one but it's water this time not putting any juice into it okay okay i've just worked out the calories for that meal that i've just had it's 550 there's 61 calories alone in the mayonnaise and the rest was obviously the chicken which I've had, but only two carbs. 
you've still got to keep an eye on your calories. Mine it's set at 2,000 a day. Well, it'll go anywhere near 2,000 today. You're lucky if I reach about 1,300 for the day, so I will be well under on my calories as well. And that's why your fat comes off so quick, if you can manage to do that. Okay, catch you in a bit. Hi, guys. Right, now I've done everything. Done all my three fish tanks. Um, and I've had a bit of a rest, so I'm going to do uh, a little bit on my weights now. I'm going to do some curls with this one and also we're going to do some press ups, some sit ups and that sort of thing. Um, I don't do this every day, I usually do this every other day. Um, just a bit more exercise, trying to keep myself trim while the gym's shut. So I'll catch you later. Okay guys, that's done about half an hour on my weights and sit ups, press ups. Curls, squats as well. There you go on this workout, 30 minutes. 182 active cal, 255 total cal, and 87 beats per minute at the moment. That went up to about 121 before. So that's my exercise done. For right, guys, I'm going to show you what app I've been using to help me. Um, record the obviously um, carbs that, uh, that I'm eating, eating each day. Now this isn't actually mine but this is actually one of the plans that you can watch. It's called Lose It and if you go in and you can add your breakfast and it'll tell you how many calories your breakfast is like I had chicken breasts with the peri peri and that was 641 um, and you carry it on like when we walk in this morning and you've got to put your weight in and everything like that but it tells you how many you've had like I'm allowed 1911 I've had 801 my exercise is minus 159 so I'm still under by 1269 calories and on mine, once you once you subscribe to this, it's about thirty five quid a year, but it's well well worth it. Like you can add everything on here, like your protein, as you can see, it's locked because this one hasn't been upgraded. Your carbohydrates, your fats, your cholesterol levels, your fibre levels, your net carbs, which is really really good for the one that we do. Um, so I highly highly recommend it. Um, I just get back and that's what it's called lose it and it's a, obviously the little orange one with a little weighing scales highly highly recommend it that counts all your carbs and everything your calories your fats everything for the day if you subscribe it's 35 quid a year but it's well worth it because it helps you every day and i use it so many times a day it records your water intake and everything so if you fancy that download it and uh, I've just had a delivery from Amazon which will be my flour that's one of them that I use for the almond flour and that one was about £14 you can actually get them from Holland and Barrett they do them in 500 grams but they're about eight quid for 500 grams so uh, I don't usually bother I have one just for an emergency and it's time for a bit more water but this time I'm going to have black currant in it um, thanks again Morrison's own no added sugar and again put the macros on it which are virtually the same. And I'm getting a little bit peckish. So what I'm going to have is one of these. It's an Atkins chocolate mint bar. Okay. It says 50% less carbs. And if you look on the back, it actually tells you there's only 2.5 net carbs in this. So that's hardly anything again. If you're on 20 a day, at least you could have one of them. When I'm on 50 a day, 
and at the moment I think I'm only up to about eight or nine for the day. Um, so obviously well under my target. So stick with me for the rest of the day and we'll see what I end up before I go to bed. Cheers guys. Alright guys for my tea, because I'm not really that hungry, I'm just going to have three of these crisp breads, which each one of them is roughly about three carbs. So I'm going to have three of them, so that's nine carbs, with some cheese and ham. And roughly, out of all what I've got on there, is another two carbs. So that's 11 carbs for that. Obviously three each, which is nine, and two of the cheese. And that's going to be my tea. Right guys, that's uh, that's my day done. I'm just going to go and have a shower and then jump in bed. And it works out, uh, I was 1,300 calories under what I'm allowed today. And I'd had 18 carbs today. Um, so, I've done really well today. Mainly with the exercise and that. But uh, I'm going to try and post... A day a week, probably, if you, people want to stick with me and watch how I get on as I get towards my goal. And that's the fish tank. Now the water's all settled. Before I go to bed. A lot clearer now. And that's one of the other ones. Now that water's cleared. Anyway, thanks for sticking with me today, guys. And don't forget, please subscribe to my channel and like it. And then just hit a little bell. And then every time I put a video on, you'll be notified. But thanks again. And I uh, hope to see you all soon. Good night. God bless.